हेलो पीपल वेलकम टू सोलफुल रिक्स हाई एवरी वन वी आर ऑल ऑफ टू लाल बाग सी माई बिग फैमिली सो वी आर हैविंग अ वंडरफुल संडे एंड इट इज वी आर लुकिंग फॉर्वर्ड टू द फ्लावर शो एंड यू नो लाल बाग इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज केम्पोटा The Lal Bagh has an history of 200 years old, and uh, the kids are excited because last two years there was no flower show, and uh, every year without miss we go to Lal Bagh, and we are looking forward to it. So beautiful flowers, all the flowers are going there. <laughs> Let's go. So view of Bangalore on a Sunday afternoon. There was flags everywhere. and there's so much of spirit of independence day we enjoyed the drive because there was full packed drive and this is the entrance of lal bag you can see the crowd everybody is ready for a sunday uh, ride in lal bag everybody wants to see uh, the flower show so much of crowd and this year lal bag uh, was dedicated to our uh, dr puneet rajkumar and dr rajkumar so there was there was lot of things related to them and it was really nice and the crowd was more interested to see uh, dr puneet rajkumar Yeah, and you can see this. People are uh, making flag on the cheeks. Uh, it is costing thirty rupees for one side. Uh, the last week in marathon, we got it for free. <laughs> so uh, I felt uh, it is bit a uh, little bit too much. Here is the ticket counter. Both entry and ticket is in the same uh, passage. You have to go through the same thing. So the price for the adults is seventy five rupees. That is twelve years plus. And uh, for uh, twelve years below, it is um, twenty five. So we were four adults and four kids. Eight of us. This is mommy, and she's trying to uh, go slowly. And that's Sumi. my sister yeah it's a rakhi week we have to talk about siblings you can see in front uh, piyush sonu and uh, pinku and ayush all those uh, cousins together the rakhi week reminds us so much about siblings it, it is a blessing to have a sibling and my sister to she's she's my fan she obeys all my orders so that's i'm lucky <laughs> this is my family and the kids you can see sumi mummy and the kids this is bonsai garden i think half of bangalore was there on sunday <laughs> Or maybe on the Independence Day it is much more. I saw the paper; it was like one lakh twenty-five thousand people visited on Saturday. That was on thirteenth of August, some number like that. Now, fast forward look of people towards a glass house. That's a spot. See the view. <laughs> It's overwhelming. Yeah first we decided to go to glass house so to save all our energy to see glass house first then to go around so 
So this is the entrance on the left side. When you go, you can see Appu. There was nice posters of Appu, and we wanted to take pictures there. And these are some uh, work which is done beautifully done. Yeah, earlier days when we used to go to these places on flower show, they used to be a photographer when we were small actually. So they used to ask, do you want a family photo for uh, this price? But now you can't find those people at all because everybody has their own camera and they can take as many. So here we are finding our way. There was this announcement going on in the mic in the uh, in Lal Bagh saying one person is missing your family is waiting here come down so one or the other person was like continuously there was an announcement so people were losing their uh, family members so we were really careful you can see Sumi holding the kids <laughs> and mommy holding the kids that side so we were always holding uh, the hands to be safe not missing them screaming from one side to another side stay together stay together <laughs> And we were making them memorize the phone numbers also on the way. This is very important. Yeah, we are inside the glass house now. You can see on the right side, we went on the right side queue. So all the display of uh, Appu uh, from his birth, all his uh, awards and all the movie names he's acted, beautifully displayed, all the pictures they have collected, they have written the full history. You can go slowly and have a look at it. It just feels that he is among us, you know. There was so much of memories captured there. We have to appreciate all the work what they have done. Netradana Mari. This is what it is showing here. It's an example uh, set by uh, Dr. Rajkumar and then uh, uh, Dr. Purit Rajkumar also. We all have to uh, register for uh, donate our eyes. This is Parvatama Rajkumar, Rajkumar and Puneet Rajkumar. Very nicely done guys. Nice smiley face they have created very nicely. And it was like you want to smile looking at those sculptures what is done there. Very well work done. So we are out of uh, glass house shopping on the side line a lot of street a lot of shops actually a lot of small vendors expecting a good sale i'm sure they would have experienced a good sale because uh, this is after a long time bangalore uh, crowd is all together after uh, so much of covid stay at home online and everything people are out uh, seeing the vendors seeing the places and buying a lot of things about seeds and uh, natural food organic food uh, artificial flowers you can see there nice display actually uh, all the shops were full that that is a happy thing and uh, these days uh, I, I really think we have to support uh, the small vendors they have suffered a lot and uh, due to covid and online and they were not able to come out so we have to support the small vendors Most of it is handmade, organic or small things which is useful for the house. So you can see all the shops are full. And this is Appu. Appu badges were there to wear it on. So these days guys, we talk about uh, local vendor shopkeepers and their businesses among our family and friends. We really uh, connect to them and uh, it is good to connect to our local vendors. You know, I go to a regular vegetable vendor near my house and he recognizes me. He'll ask me, Madam, yak nende bandila. <laughs> that is like, it's nice. You know, you, you are talking to the same vendor every day. You might give 5 rupees, 10 rupees more. It doesn't matter. He will give you a qualitative uh, product and um, i think we should avoid uh, negotiating much with these people because they work on very thin margin and they sit on the shop for a whole day 
and looking for a business to earn uh, uh, that margin and most of the time we are comparing to online prices which is really not fair because they have a shop and they have a person to pay or to take care i hope you guys understand and you agree with me and i request you all to support the shopkeepers this is really a big uh, boost for the small businesses so here we are out to eat something kids were really hungry we didn't had lunch when we left so we just went straight to potato twisters yeah kids enjoying on the tree and that's ashwin trying to climb on the tree <laughs> trying his fitness level <laughs> yeah yeah he succeeded yeah out for shopping again beautiful stuff guys actually rare things you will find here so we went into this wooden uh, flower shop where uh, there's lot of things which this guy is doing a handmade uh, stuff actually yeah this one he is making a handmade uh, wooden flowers beautiful ones it is all handmade by the guy who owns the shop i bought uh, quite a few because i found this is a little rare and you're finding a lot of nice ones like cherry and nice color flowers so we picked up one uh, full bunch yeah as i said i didn't negotiate with him he told me 700 i said okay so he was happy he said are you okay to pay 700 i said okay then he gave me happily two more twisters <laughs> so i was happy and he was happy so here piyush climbing the lalbag rock this is 3000 million uh, old yeah uh, oldest rock around us and this watch tower you know it is built by kempe gowda we all have learned in our uh, school right yeah view from uh, lalbag rock earlier there used to be water in that place i think now the uh, it is actually to nida nida agudide going back home it's already 6:30 pm full of flags on the street thank you so much for watching guys please like and subscribe thank you, thank you.